What's up school fans, Bagung Gorki Padila Hari ini gue langsung ke Gor Cipaka Putih Untuk melipat pertandingan scrimmage Antara Satria Wadah Pertamina melawan Bali United Basketball Dan guys, kita kurang dari satu bulan lagi guys Menuju IBL Season 2023 I am super hype Dan sekarang semua tim sudah mulai mempersiapkan diri mereka secara serius Untuk menghadapi season yang baru nanti ini Dan ya, sebelum kita mulai Gue mau say thank you so much kepada Satria Wadah Pertamina Dan juga Bali United Yang sudah mengizinkan gue untuk melipat pertandingan hari ini Dari Satria Wadah Pertamina Gue excited banget hari ini untuk melihat AJ West AJ West ini benar-benar menunjukkan kualitasnya di sebagai defensive minded player dia hari ini ada beberapa blok yang bagus dan juga seru banget sih ngelihat dia match up lawan Dior Lohon dan pemain lokalnya SM seperti biasa lah ya mereka playing basketball the right way enak banget ditontonnya tadi Lau sama Sandi juga ada Dang Dang so I think they'll be alright lah ya next season and of course dari Bali United Dior Lohon in a very good spirit dia pengen banget membawa Bali United untuk bisa lolos ke playoff pertama kalinya nanti di IBL season 2023 tapi dia harapannya pengen ada pemain lokalnya Bali United yang step up selama regular season tadi sih itu nama Abraham Wenas hari ini mainnya cukup bagus menurut gue dan gue harap Abraham Wenas bounce back season sih next season ini uh, I have a lot of faith in him untuk bisa main bagus lagi di Bali United next season so tanpa panjang lebar guys bagi kalian yang ingin nonton hal ini secara full kalian bisa join jadi member dan bagi kalian yang lain hopefully you guys gonna enjoy the highlight jangan lupa untuk like jangan lupa untuk comment and nanti jangan lupa untuk nonton interview juga at the end of the video and once again really appreciate everybody and enjoy the highlights Thank <laughs> you. 
We are here with Dior Lohorn from Bali United. Dior, how are you doing, man? I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. I'm live, healthy, another year in the IBL. Good to see you again. So everything's all good, man. It's a quick turnaround for you after a long season. Last, oh, not, not last year yet, but last season. And yeah. now a very short off season for you. How's that body, man? You're not young anymore. And how was your off season? Uh, man, it was a quick turnaround. We basically mm -hmm. went all the way to the finals mm -hmm. pretty much almost to September. I think the last game was like August 29th. So I was home, what, just like two or three months mm -hmm. and then uh, back out here now. So um, like I said, the body, uh, okay. the body's feeling OK. I got to get it a little bit better. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, I got good genetics. I, you know, I, I take care of myself. I don't put nothing in my body. You know, I don't drink. I don't smoke. Yeah. Uh, I like food, but working on that diet. But uh, you know, I just I got good genetics, man. And and the way I play is kind of like I can play. You could say I could play forever the way my style. But you know, we'll see, man. I got one, two years left, and I think that'll be it. But it's good to be back, though, man. And coming into the season, you're coming into a different situation. Yes. Uh, I know you've been with the top two teams before, and you've always been in the finals <laughs> whenever you're in, in the IBL. Yeah. And now, Bali United okay. is, you know, legitly expecting you to carry them to their first playoff run. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And do you have any different mindset coming into this season? Um, uh, I mean, in terms of like, uh, I mean, first off, I think the, the roster they put together is actually is a pretty good roster. So I'm expecting, you know, more or less the same thing. I know, I, I, I know, obviously with PJ and SM, it's, 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 you know, it's easier, it's different. But uh, 
I mean, I'm still expecting, you know, something kind of special, like definitely making the playoffs. I mean, the roster mm -hmm. didn't put together eight teams make the playoffs. I mean, we definitely think about <laughs> making the playoffs. I mean, we're, we're actually trying to compete for the top four teams, honestly. Uh, you know, we know SM and PJ will be there. Uh, the, the teams we're trying to compete with is, is, is competing with them and getting maybe one or two wins against one of those teams. And then, and then like, we're, we're competing with, like, the Prariwas and the, the Daywas. You know, those are kind of the next – best team so we want to be right in that mix and then from there we just you know if we can get one or two against SM or split with one of them and take care of the, all the other teams then we'll put ourselves in vision for like a top four because I'm, I'm thinking top four because if you get a higher seed you know a long season this is yeah. six months away from now yeah. but we know if you get a if you do your work early and you get wins early it, it takes care of itself and in the playoffs you want to get a higher seed so you don't play the harder teams uh, first, if you get a, you know, if you get a three or four seed, you play a five or a six, instead of getting eight or nine yeah. and you play one or two. So, yeah, man. <laughs> and, as you said, that uh, you like, you know, the build of this team. Yeah. And of course, uh, not a lot of players have a lot of playoff experience on this team. Uh, yeah. You are expected to play a bigger role as well. Yeah. Uh, but I know you just been here for like what a week now. Yeah, like ten days. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like ten days. But yeah. just first impression of this team, man. I mean, like I said, we uh, we got some vets. We got a couple vets that have done some stuff, like Sandy, CLS. He took a couple, you know, years off though. It's been two years, but we got Galang. We got you know, Bima, Bima Luffy. We got a couple guys that have, you know, played. You know, if I look around, he played for Ass Pack. Yeah. So we got we got guys that have Abraham now too. So we got like six or seven guys that have some some experience, some playoff experience. So uh, they added some pieces to be able to help with, you know, some of the younger guys that haven't necessarily maybe been in the playoffs. So, um, you know, we got we got good shooters, we got good bigs. Um, you know, our point guard Abraham's good. We just got to be able to be more strong with the ball, chemistry, and uh, you know, obviously we're missing Coach Tony right now. Yeah. So that that that's going to help a bunch when he finally gets here. In the next two weeks, I think he's going to be here. So that'll that'll help a lot. I mean, having him, you see what he did with NSH. He was able to help elevate mm -hmm. them to a top four team, basically, I think. Right, towards the end of the season, they lost a couple, but they made the playoffs, and they were a top four team all year, pretty much, kind of, up until, you know, the playoffs, and, you know, they didn't. But we're hoping Coach Tony helps elevate us as well. So I think with the players and Coach Tony and the staff, we'll be able to you know reach the top four like we like i hope we want to do you know so and you this too, is man. one of the guys that have been you know following me i guess on maybe since look, abl yeah man. since abl like, even before ibl it's been like yeah. 10 years man i know it's, so it's been a long time 2013 so yeah yeah hopefully bro. we're gonna see vintage dior man hey man <laughs> You get Mike, maybe you'll get you'll get the MJ you'll get the MJ Wizards Dior. Yeah. We're still effective, but old. We need that Saigon hit Dior. Hey man, that's ten years. That's that's hard to bring that out. That's twenty. That's twenty five year old Dior. Yo, thank once you. again, thank you so much, man. Appreciate you, bro. Thank yes, you. sir. All right. We're here with the new Satria Muda, AJ. AJ, how you doing, man? I'm good, man. AJ, so I know you've been in this part of the world. Yeah. You played for the Malaysia Dragons before. Does that make your adjustment easier? And how was your first two weeks in Jakarta? Um, honestly, yeah, it does. It makes everything easier. I've been to this part of the world, and I've been around a lot of a, a lot of players, like with Asian descent and stuff like that. So yeah, um, the the last week since, since I've been here, I've got adjusted to the. Um, the practice, mm -hmm. my coach, my teammates. I'm still trying to get used to some of the plays, but I'll get there by the time the season starts. Obviously, yeah. you got Elijah here, yeah, yeah, your sure. former teammates yeah. at Nevada. You play like two years, I think, two seasons yeah, two with games. him. Yep. And how's your relationship with him? And how much information <laughs> has he given you about the IBL? That I mean, that's my boy. Uh, uh -huh. We go back, I guess, 10 years. So, of course, we're close right now. Mm -hmm. And Honestly, I didn't know too much about the IBL, and mm -hmm. he informed me about it, told me, like, AJ, let's go, like, come over mm -hmm. here. And so I came, and I'm really happy with my decision so far. And, of course, on the SM Vlogs, Man. I know that you haven't been playing 5-on-5 five five in a while. Yeah, you, yep. yeah, you've been playing 3x3. Yeah. Uh, how much adjustment going back to 5-on-5? Five five? And I know the coach is trying to get your yeah. conditioning back, yeah. too. And how far are we from AJ? of Nevada who oh, was yeah. like very bouncy. <laughs> I, 
bouncy like you mean dunks? <laughs> yeah, dunks, okay, and you're you. running. Um, you know? Honestly, it, it just takes a couple of weeks, mm -hmm. like just going through preseason and stuff like that. I, Honestly, with, with the bouncy and stuff like that, I need to get adjusted to the players. Like sometimes I'm out there and I don't honestly know what to do with the teammates. Uh -huh. So I'm sure these next two, three weeks, I'm gonna get that down. And um, I feel like we'll be good, me and Elijah. And of course, yeah. question, I know you wanna bring the championship yeah. again to Sir Trey How can you help them win back-to-back -back championship this season? Uh, basically, just what I said, um, mm. I feel like I should be a defensive anchor on this team in, in terms of rebounding and blocking shots. That's what I do. That's my um, my niche. Mm -hmm. So I definitely think I could do that. And me and Eliza, as a dynamic duo, the two <laughs> of us, the mm -hmm. big man in the paint, I think we could do it. And last one, what do you think about the local players of Sochi and Oh, man. Um, I mean, I've only seen mm -hmm. two teams, but <laughs> the difference in the way they play, it's like, it's like, I'm so happy, like the way like making layups. Like <laughs> Weedy was in there, yeah, like eight, I uh, Alan Iverson, <laughs> like this. I was like, I'm very, I'm very happy about everybody. It, it, it looks like a, a really fun season is about to happen. Good luck, yeah. man, and stay healthy, and yeah. hopefully you can win the championship yeah. for Southern with AJ. Thank you. Appreciate you, man. E, how's your boy, man? How's your boy? Yeah, my boy's doing good, man. <laughs> just, just gotta get him used to like the weather. <laughs> to like, you know. You gotta take a picture of him. <laughs> it's a know? video though. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's a video. What is the video? Soon? Yeah. Yeah, special things right. coming coming soon. Let's, Let's do it. It's gonna be a We're going huge. back to back, bro. You know. Back to back to back. Let's do it. Back to back to back to back. Three so people at yeah. SM. Yeah. Back to Let's back for it. me. Let's First one for like my yeah. man's. Yeah. Rocky man, we in here. We in trash, here the whole season. Trash talk coming at the end, end of the by season. The time, <laughs> by the time of the season, I'm gonna have the same beard. <laughs> <laughs>